Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix AMD graphic driver error 182 in Windows 10 and Windows 11. So it, there comes a message from AMD that says, oops, something went wrong. Error 182, Radeon software install detect AMD graphic hardware in your system configuration that is not supported with the software installation. So there are quick three uh, fixes that you can apply. And after that, I'm sure that this problem will be fixed. So what you have to do first, look for your Windows icon on Windows 10 or 11, right click on it and choose Device Manager. Now here you have to look for your display adapters, double click on it, and then you will find AMD Radeon Graphics, right click on it and choose Update Driver. Then click on Search Automatically for Drivers. And if there are update available, it will automatically update it. And once updated, you have to restart your PC and check back that if the problem has been fixed. But if you get the same message that the best driver for your device are already installed, then you need to close it. Again, right click on it and choose properties. Then from here, click on the driver tab and try to click on rollback driver. Choose any other option, click on yes. And this will just roll back to the older version of AMD graphic driver. So probably that will be fixing the problem. All right, you can check after that. And still, if you have issues, then you have to close it. Again, right click on AMD Radeon graphic, update driver, click browse my computer for drivers and choose let me pick from a list of available driver on my computer. And from here, you can choose the one that is from the latest date. So let's say that 428 2022 is the latest one. So you have to click on it and then click on next. So once you click on next, it will ask you to install it and the driver will be installed. And after that, you can check back and see that if the problem has been fixed. And if not, then you have to go ahead and update your windows. So click on the search box type update. Click on check for updates. Again here, click on check for updates. And if there are updates available, it will start downloading and installing it. So wait for the update till it get completed. And after that, uh, restart your PC and check back that if the problem has been fixed. I'm very sure that after applying all these solutions, your problem will be fixed. And if yes, then please consider subscribing to the channel, like the video and let me know still if you have issues. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.